In Puerto Rico, these are what shattered dreams look like. A mammoth solar farm decimated by Hurricane Maria. And across this beautiful island, miles of mangled power poles. It's very hard, Consuelo Burgos says. She and her husband have been without power for 46 days. So imagine the skepticism at a children's hospital in San Juan when it got a call from a tech giant with a bright idea. Did it sound too good to be true? Yes. Juliana Canino Rivera is the administrator at El Hospital del Niño, now outfitted with more than 700 brand new solar panels, thanks to Tesla. The facility houses 35 children with disabilities like cerebral palsy. After the storm, the power was out and fuel for generators was nearly impossible to find. It was chaos. It was chaos. Now they are grateful for Tesla's donation. The company's founder, Elon Musk, calls it the first of many solar and battery projects going live on the island. We have to reinvent uh, life as we know it. But reinventing life by going solar won't be easy. Puerto Rico's publicly funded electric company went bankrupt in July after a president of the Electrical Workers Union says that while solar technology... We receive sun 365 days a year. An island shattered, but not broken. Gabe Gutierrez, NBC News, Umaca, Puerto Rico. Hey, NBC News fans, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking on that button down here and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives. Thanks for watching.